saying that uh, Bob Colimo will be buried tomorrow. And of course, tributes have poured in for his demise, including one from President Uhuru Kenyatta, who uh, also eulogized Kolima as a distinguished corporate leader whose contribution to see national well-being will be missed. His Deputy William Ruto also lauded Kolima for his tenure at Safaricom that saw him uh, steer the company to new heights, contributing immensely to the evolution of Kenya's uh, corporate scene. ODM leader Raila Odinga also sent his message of condolence together with National Assembly Speaker Justin Moturi and his Senate counterpart Ken Lusaka. May his soul rest in eternal peace. Moving on now, President Uru Kenyatta today held talks with his South Sudan counterpart Salva Kiri at State House Nairobi. President Uru assured South Sudan of Kenya's support in economic and security sectors. Uru said Kenya has set aside 10 acres of land at the Naivasha Dry Port to be used by the South Sudanese government. On his part, President Kiri said he is optimistic that the joint technical team put in place to resolve border dispute between Kenya and South Sudan will be successful. To ease the movement of goods consigned to South Sudan, the Kenya government has responded to the request of South Sudan to set aside 10 acres of land at the inland container depot in Naivasho Industrial Park for use as a dry port by the government of South Sudan. Under resolution of the country in the Republic of South Sudan. And in this connection, South Sudan has registered once again its profound gratitude to the government and people of Kenya for the sustained support to peace efforts 